What's up, Club Club? To welcome back to another video. So, guys, I kind of wanted to make this video because this has been something that's on my mind for like a pretty long time now, and I thought this might be a pretty cool video idea because you guys might have also been a little confused on what's going on here. So, you guys probably read the title and thumbnail, so you guys probably know what I'm about to talk about. But like what every other YouTuber does, I gotta pretend like you don't know what I'm about to say. So, on the murder mystery page, it's pretty cool, and you know, there's a couple social links down in the murder mystery page. There's Nicholas's Twitter, as you know, it goes straight to Nicholas's Twitter, pretty normal. And there's also the murder mystery Discord server, um, it just gives you a pretty easy invite to get in the Discord, pretty nice. But in the middle, there's a YouTube page, videos coming soon, subscribe to be the first to see them. So at first glance, you might think, well, maybe it's like JD's channel, right? JD works for murder mystery, and they are a YouTube channel, so I might just go to JD. I mean, for one, the description doesn't make it sound like it's JD. And for two, if you click it, it goes to a Nicholas YouTube channel. This is actually very interesting. I can see Nicholas has 162,000 subscribers for some reason. He doesn't have a single video, and he already has 100,000 subscribers. Nicholas, do you have a play button, bro? I kind of want to know. And I bet if Nicholas wanted to, he might be able to get in the star program. I mean, maybe not since he has no videos, but I mean, he has a subscriber count for it. Yeah, as you can see, Nicholas has no videos at all which is definitely kind of interesting he does have a community post though from one year ago he linked one of jd's videos of uh, the christmas 2019 event it's actually kind of interesting it's like the only thing he's ever done on his youtube channel and there's a lot of people that like are commenting on it for some reason i mean i'm just gonna say if you're trying to contact nicholas youtube is probably not the way to do it but i mean okay he has a couple feature channels. He has JD, he has Joven, and he also has this person. I don't know who this person is exactly. I guess they're one of Nicholas's friends since she also has Nicholas as a featured channel. Yeah, definitely really interesting as because Nicholas says there's going to be videos coming soon. So that's kind of what I wanted to talk about in this video. If Nicholas does ever make videos on YouTube like he says he might, what sort of videos would be on his channel? Well, hopefully Nicholas does end up making a video on how to fix your head size because I feel like Nicholas kind of struggling on that right now as you guys can see. So if you guys are excited make sure to drop a like, subscribe for new, and turn on those post notifications. Never miss a new video so you can join the club club. And be sure to down in the comment let me know if you'd watch Nicholas's videos if he ever did release videos on his YouTube channel because I know I would man. I'm gonna turn on notifications right now because I'm not gonna miss out. So I don't even know if Nicholas will ever upload like that might just be like a scrapped project, but like what could he do? So the first possible thing he could do is his YouTube channel and do what other Roblox developers do. Like for example, Asimo3089. This guy is the creator of Jailbreak and he does actually have a couple videos on his channel. And most of them seem to be like trailers for like the next Jailbreak updates. As you guys can see, there's literally one called Jailbreak Trailer. And there's like a lot of other videos showing off like leaks and teasers and stuff. So that would be super cool if Nicholas did like end up releasing like leaks and teasers and like update trailers to his channel that would be super cool and i'm pretty sure there's a lot more roblox developers that do release videos another example is big games the creator of like pet simulator and other games they do have a couple trailers of games they make and of course there are like a lot of other roblox developers that do release like trailers on their youtube channel I'm just showing off some examples, and that would be super cool if Nicholas did, like, end up putting out some trailers for his channel. That would be pretty poggers, I'm not gonna lie to you. Another idea that he could do is he could do something similar to what Nicholas does on TikTok. Because Nicholas does actually have a TikTok. If you guys have never seen uh, these TikToks he made, he has made two of them before. So I guess I'll show you them right now. That's something, and uh, he also has made another one too. This might actually be like copyrighted. I'll just put in my own music in the background um, while this video plays, I guess. Staying active tips here, running, boxing, lifting weights, and doing this. Yeah, he made these TikToks around like a year ago. He could like make like funny videos like that on his YouTube channel. Like Nicholas could like make YouTube shorts on his channel. And like he could just make like more like funny skit videos like that. Cause of course his channel doesn't have to be murder mystery and this TikTok, it kind of shows it because this is not like a murder mystery TikTok. So hey, even if Nicholas does not release murder mystery YouTube videos, I'd still watch him. I also know that Nicholas does post stuff on Instagram sometimes. Alright, he did just make a 
a, a recent Instagram post. Oh, this is actually 16 hours ago Nicholas made this. It's probably more like over a day for you guys. You know, Nicholas does make like a lot of uh, Instagram. Well, he doesn't make a lot, but he definitely does make a couple Instagram posts every now and then. What's this? What does this mean? Oh, one week ago, he had this uh, story of the nebula. That's kind of cool. So, okay, so most of the Instagram posts are talking about murder mystery. He's only made two Instagram posts that aren't um, MM2 related, this one and this one, but the rest of them are relating to murder mystery. I mean, he could make community posts on his YouTube account, like showing these off. Cause as we've seen, Nicholas is totally capable of making community posts on his channel. He's done it before. So he could definitely do it on YouTube. He doesn't have to make YouTube videos. He could just make YouTube community posts. That would be something. I mean, I would prefer videos though. Yeah, Nicholas even has his YouTube account in his pinned tweet. So we know Nicholas is really out here. Like, well, he's not like super out here promoting his YouTube, but yeah, that's pretty much everything I could expect Nicholas to release on his channel. Either like funny skit videos like he do, does on TikTok. He could release like some leaks and trailers. He does release like some leaks on Instagram and he could like post on his community post whenever he actually releases an update because he's only done that once or he could release like some full-on trailers like other Roblox developers do like YouTube is probably one of the best places to promote that because YouTube is obviously one of the most popular social media websites I don't even know if YouTube counts as social media I don't know even JD has Nicholas in his featured channel so I mean they were obviously planning on like posting stuff on his YouTube but they just Never have. Hey, Nicholas, better late than never, dude. It's not too late to release a video on YouTube. What is going on here? I just went back to freaking murder mystery, and there's like a ton of people standing on me while I'm murder. What the frick? But yeah, it's pretty much all to it to this video. I just want to talk about. Uh, if Nicholas will ever release a video on his YouTube channel, and if he ever does, like, what would he post? And that's pretty much all the things that, like, we could expect him to post on his YouTube if he ever does release. Oh, wow, how did I not get that guy, man? I swear that knife, like, went straight at him, but I guess not. I, sh I expected at least a tie from that. So, guys, be sure to let me know in the comment section what you think Nicholas could release on his YouTube channel. You guys might have some pretty cool ideas of what Nicholas could post. Nick, maybe Nicholas will watch this video and he'll be like, oh, frick, I gotta post some videos, man. I mean, Nicholas is on some JD videos, I know. Like, he was on this video, I did watch this, and he was also on this video, so Nicholas d does um, show up in some of JD's videos. And I if you just search up Nicholas in JD's YouTube channel. I bet Nicholas is in, like, a lot of these videos, right? So hey, Nicholas obviously knows how YouTube works and he's been in enough of these. So maybe he will step in the path of working on his own YouTube channel like he did say he would. Yeah guys, that's pretty much all I have to say in this video. I'm not gonna drag it on for any longer because I feel like I've been doing that. So until next time, I'm Colby. Goodbye.